There are thousands upon thousands of e-learning platforms out there. So you're probably really confused what the best platform is for you. Good thing is we have been doing this. E-learning partners has been doing this for almost a decade. And we have worked with dozens upon dozens of e-learning platforms. And we have been to even more e-learning conferences and interacted with so many pieces of e-learning technology over the years that we know the three best e-learning platforms for you and your learners specific needs. Welcome to the e-learning simplified YouTube channel. I'm Johnny Havey, one of the co-founders of e-learning partners, the organization that created this YouTube channel for you. This YouTube channel is a learner centric channel focused on simplifying your e-learning program, online course and virtual training so that you can create and launch and distribute your e-learning program to your learners as quickly as possible and create remarkable value for them. So let's make that technology decision a little easier on you today. We have three of the best e-learning platforms for you to use, but depending on what your learners need and who they are, will dictate which platform is best for you. Let's start by defining that there are two types of e-learning programs. There are internal and there are external. This is really important because a lot of people when they're looking at e-learning softwares and you're looking at thousands of e-learning softwares, you're just like, I don't even know where to start in this, in this process. There's so many, it's crazy. Well, easy answer to where you start is you always start with your learners. Well, are your learners internal or external to your organization or to you personally? If they are internal, this means that they are employees, contractors, or they're just team members. Basically, internal means you are creating an e-learning program to train your internal teams or to scale up your internal teams. Because maybe you are just an individual right now, but you want to hire some people. Create an internal e-learning program, you'll be able to scale out your training. External, this means that you're creating an e-learning program to sell to a customer. So in this case, your learners are customers. They're gonna purchase your program. Super important. Why? Because if you're an internal or an external e-learning program, let's say you're internal. Well, now those thousands and thousands of e-learning softwares, you can cut in half. Same thing, external. If you were externally facing, now you've already cut your decision in half. You have half the amount of systems and platforms to look at. We're gonna make it even easier for you though now. We're gonna give you two internal softwares and one external software that we believe are the best softwares as of this date that you see in the YouTube video below. Now, when we're saying best, we're not saying these are the best softwares ever created. Our definition of best is very simple. Best equals the cost is disproportionately low for the value it's creating. Simpler way to say this is, these may not be the best softwares, but for the cost, they are the highest value you can possibly invest in, for you and for your learners. So let's start with internal. For the internal programs, when we're talking about a manageable cost and a whole lot of value. The first one we really like is talent cards. Talent cards, phenomenal e-learning platform. And here's why. Talent cards is simple first, okay? Simple. It's simple for you. It's simple for your learner. Why is it simple for you? Well, it's like creating an Instagram post about each module you want to teach your learners. Super simple, you already know how to create an Instagram post. You'll know how to create a talent card. On the flip side, your learners are probably 
used to using smartphones. This is kind of a generalization. If you're not sure, remember, always ask your learners. Your learners are the most important part of e-learning. Always ask your learners. But we're not debating that today. We're giving you three really high quality options for you to consider. Talent cards, simple. The user experience for your learners matches their social media experiences that they're already having. So you don't have to teach them a new behavior. That's why we love talent cards. Some other things. Well, talent cards is mobile focused, which means that your learners can access their training anywhere and have a phenomenal user experience. Another cool thing is the trainings are available offline. So if you have learners who may not always have an internet connection, they'll still be able to access their training. It's kind of like Netflix, where you can download, like pre-download shows and movies that you want to watch. If you know you're not going to have internet access, you can do the same thing. They can download, they can pre-download trainings. Pretty cool. So if you want to learn more about talent cards and you want to support us, because we're giving you this awesome knowledge so you don't have to look through these thousands and thousands of options, we have a link down in the description. No extra cost to you, but it does show your support to us. We really appreciate it. So that's the first one. And remember, this is internal. Now, the second one, and these aren't in any particular order. The second one is Talent LMS. Yes, these are from the same company. Pretty cool because if you like Talent LMS and you like Talent Cards, they can integrate together. And they're both also really low cost. And one thing they both have in common is you can actually start using either one of these e-learning softwares for free. You can literally build out an entire course and test it on your learners without paying a dime. Like we said, low cost, high value, best. That's how we're defining best. So Talent LMS is much more robust than Talent Cards. And importance of this is, especially you educators and e-learning and education professionals out there who are looking for a system that you can customize at a ton of gamification. Yes, Talent Cards does have gamification, but Talent LMS has a ton of gamification. It also, for the really smart people out there, has the ability to have SCORM, HTML5, etc. Tons of file type options, tons of customization. There's an SSO, which means you can integrate it into your internal systems extremely well. Phenomenal LMS, also pretty low cost. And you can start for free, build out your program, test it on a couple learners, and then if it works, it works. You make the long-term purchase, which is still pretty reasonable, or if it doesn't work, move on to something else. We have a link in the description below for you to check out Talent LMS. Yet again, if you use that link, it just shows you that you support us. And remember, we are cutting down the time that it would take you to look at those thousands of systems. And lastly, this is an internal software. Really important because we haven't talked about any sales and marketing functionality in Talent Cards or Talent LMS. Doesn't mean that it can't happen. They both can integrate with other programs that have that. But if you're creating an external program for customers, why don't we use an external type of e-learning technology? So here is the number one recommendation. We have four external e-learning programs. Kajabi. I'm using blue because it's one of their branding colors. But Kajabi is phenomenal. There are plenty of technologies similar to Kajabi out there. Kartra is one. Thinkific is one. Here's why we like Kajabi over those. Kartra, yes, it does more. Yes, it's about the same amount of money. But if you're not a really technical person, you're going to hate your life using Kartra. And your learners are not the only user that matters when you're choosing a technology. You are a user. Your team is a user. 
Soft dollars, hard dollars. We have a video all about that on our YouTube channel. Look at that. The more you can decrease those soft dollars, which is your team learning how to use a platform. Now, the reason why we like talent cards and talent LMS, easy to use. Kajabi is the easiest. It is the simplest technology to use when it comes to an externally facing e-learning program software. And Kajabi has all the sales functionality. So it basically has everything that you see over here where it hosts courses, you can create courses, all this stuff. There's a mobile aspect, all of that. But it also has email campaigns. Sales funnels. A website builder. Landing page builder. Forms. And the list really keeps going on and on. It has everything you need to sell and market your course in addition to hosting it and delivering it to your learners. Our course is built on Kajabi. Now what we tell people, and this is our pro tip here, pro tip, Kajabi can be used for internal training. Talent LMS can be used for external training. So now you're like, okay, well like, now I knew what I wanted, but now you're like, now I don't know again. Here's the pro tip. Whatever the primary use of that training is, you select an e-learning platform for that use. So if your primary use of your training is to sell, pick Kajabi. If your primary use of your training is an internal training to train your teams, look at Talent Cars, look at Talent LMS. Or at least when you're talking to your learners, just know that you're looking for an internal platform first. And if it has some external functionality, that's cool too, because you can create a new profit center, which we talk about in our free masterclass, how maybe you wanted to create an internal training, but didn't know what kind of value you could get out of the same training from an external perspective. We talk about that in our free masterclass. We talk about a lot in our free masterclass. The goal of our free masterclass is to help you create and launch a successful e-learning program, online course, or virtual training every time by using the three pillars of e-learning and most importantly, focusing on your learners, you will virtually guarantee success. If you wanna check out that masterclass, it is linked below. When you sign up, you will get free and instant access to it. Pretty cool. And you can take all of this knowledge to the next level. To recap, these are not the only internal and external e-learning platforms. And in the end, really the only thing that matters is your learners. So if you are not fully sure what your learners wants and needs are, don't necessarily jump in and use any of these platforms. The cool thing, like we said though, is literally you can use all three of these platforms for free to test. I think you get a month of Kajabi free by using our link below. You get a month of using Kajabi for free. So you can literally build the course and then test it on your learners before you pay for it. Like we said, you can do the same thing in talent cards and talent LMS. That's why we like these. That's why we say they're the best for the cost and the value you get because there's very low risk on your part. We are extremely excited to continue to give you valuable content that is learner focused. So if you want to stay up to date with that content, give us a subscribe and then remember, give this video a thumbs up and we'll see you in the next video. So you've decided that you have some expertise you want to share with the world, but you're wondering what are the best types of e-learning content that you can create? And more importantly, what are the best types of e-learning content that are simple? to create.